Longtime Missouri lawmaker Vicki Hartzler's failed Senate run in the primary election has opened a spot in Congressional District 4, which serves 24 Missouri counties. Now, Republican Mark Alford, a former Kansas City news anchor, is running against Democrat Jack Truman, a self-proclaimed non-politician. Good evening and welcome to Color 10 News at 9. I'm Lauren Barnes. Color 10 is your local election headquarters, and tonight, Color 10 Shadia Tomlin is here in studio hearing from both candidates ahead of this election. Shadia? That's right. As elections get closer, both candidates talk to us here at Color 10 about their stances on some of the hot topics voters are talking about. Democrat Jack Truman and Republican Mark Alford battle to be Missouri's fourth congressional district representative, a spot vacated by Vicki Hartzler. Both candidates focusing on inflation. Regular people, they're just struggling to get by. Gas, food, rent, utilities. Uh, it's hard for a regular person. That's more than relevant in this district. People are filling up once, sometimes twice a week, having to choose between uh, you know, filling up their tanks or filling up their stomachs. We've got to get people back to work. I think that was a major cause for some of these issues that we're seeing now. Alfred received an endorsement from former President Donald Trump. I'm very honored to have the endorsement of President Trump. My commitment to America and, and putting America first, but also putting the fourth district first. The more we divide people and keep people isolated and separated, the more things aren't going to get done. When you have a divider like President Trump, endorsing my opponent. I think that's uh, good for Jack Truman. The 4th District covers areas of West Central Missouri. Much of it is rural and includes Lebanon up to Harrisonville, east of Columbia. Each candidate has a different approach to reaching their voters across the Ozarks ahead of the midterms. Even though this is a conservative district, uh, because of my values, I can connect and relate to a lot of people that live around here. With me being both a liberal and a conservative, having those values, I think I'm able to really uh, connect to locals here in the district. I have spent the last 14 months really in the district talking with people, hearing their concerns, going to every county seat, going to the, the town squares, going into businesses, going into homes. Both candidates say that it is important to head to the polls and vote this Tuesday. Lauren.